Yep, most good job, ladies and gentlemen, kings, queens. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling today? We got the deadly war in East London. Ma Molly Strip versus LGR. This is brought to us by UK Drill Plug and was recommended by Caden, I believe. I appreciate you again. You know what I'm saying? Let's get some more to it. Oh, that's my birthday. W time. Right. Jaden Moody, 14 years old. He was murdered on the 8th of January this year. Oh, According to Trident, they're responsible for seven murders. Murdered on the 8th of January this year. What According year to Trident, they're responsible for seven murders in three years or less. That we know of. In this video, we are heading to East London, specifically okay. the borough of Waltham Forest, where a large street gang named Molly Strip operates around Leighton. Molly Strip is divided into two different sets, one being L Tizzy, which controls the E10 postcode, and okay. one being SJ, which controls the E17 postcode. Gotcha. Molly Strip formed in the early 2015s, before members were a part of the Beaumont Boys, but the Olders would split off and make their own set naming it Molly Strip. This was most likely to make more money. Molly Strip doesn't really focus on postcode wars, but instead the local drug trade being one of the richest gangs in London. They even keep track of police number plates and police presence in order to not get arrested. A few That's streets away from Molly Strip are tank. their main ops named LGR. They were once allied with Molly Strip in one gang called the Beaumont Boys, but would begin to have a rivalry Always after Molly Strip would separate from Beaumont Boys. Beaumont Boys Always is not really a gang anymore, with it now being LGR that run the Beaumont Estate. The Beaumont Boys have been around since the 1990s, and is referred to as LGR by the younger generation. LGR stands for Let's Get Rich and Leighton Green Riders. Molly okay. Strip also has a deadly beef with nearby Priory Court, which has been going on for a few years as well. In 2015, Molly Strip members would start shotting on Beaumont's block. Allegedly, a Shotting. fight would happen between Molly Strip members and Beaumont Olders. LGR would get involved after an LGR. See, with the lingo, it's just like it, it, it throws me off, especially when words are already. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so is that like. Uten? Or is that. Abin? Talk to me. Uh, rumors, I'm sorry. Just wondering. A fight would happen between Molly Strip members and Beaumont Olders. LGR would get involved after an LGR older shot Hunter Molly what Strip to death in 2016. This would spark LGR, which was a younger set from Beaumont to start beefing Molly Strip. On the 7th of May 2017, Wait. Hunter Molly Strip. Beaumont Olders, LGR would get involved after an LGR older shot Hunter Molly Strip to death in 2016. This would spark LGR, How which was a younger already... set from Beaumont to start beefing and Molly Strip. On the 7th of May 2017, a Molly Strip member named EJ was out in Walthamstow High Street with a friend. Allegedly, him and his friend were out trapping that night. Two LGR GMs would also be out that night and would ambush EJ and his friend. The two LGR members would stab EJ once in the stomach. EJ would run into a cafe and collapse, and his intestines had started to fall out of his stomach oh as a result of the attack. Gosh, Sadly, bro. EJ would be pronounced dead two hours All later. Right, the bro. LGR GMs were caught on CCTV right, fleeing the scene. Like, ain't shit happened. They would be caught by police just a few days after the incident. Ezra, LGR, and Morgan, LGR, would be convicted and given life sentences for this incident. Rest in peace to EJ, my thoughts and prayers are with his family. A few Agreed. days after EJ's death, Ezra, LGR, who was EJ's killer, was in an arcade in Walthamstow. Five Molly Strip members would find Ezra and shoot at him whilst he was in the arcade. This was all caught on CCTV, but it is way too graphic to show on YouTube. Ezra would be arrested not long after this for the murder of EJ. A few months after this incident, in November 2017, an LGR member named DS would start dropping songs and would document the beef in these songs. He released Leighton's Calling, which would show UK drill fans what was really happening in Walthamstow. In March 2018, three Molly Strip members would seek retaliation for the murder of EJ, EJ. and would gotcha. ride to their op block with intention to find their ops. They would spot a Priory Court member named Nino. The Molly Strip members would spy on Nino, and then they would shoot him in the chest, killing him whilst he was sitting in his van with his friend listening to music. He was not a part of LGR, but he was a part of Priory Court, which Molly Strip also heavily beefed. The three Molly Strip members were handed life sentences for his murder, and will likely remain in prison for most likely the rest of their life. 
the gun used to murder Nino was allegedly the same gun that was used in the murder of Nisha by Wood Green. One of the members that killed Nino was named Hammers. He was also found guilty of the murder of Kizzy in 2017. Kizzy was another Priory Court member. Hammers was sentenced to 28 years for the murder of Nino and was also found guilty for the murder of Kizzy. During the court trial, police would search Hammers' home and would find a hit list that Hammers wrote. This had the names of many different ops. The hit list had the names Nino and Kizzy crossed out. It is likely Hammers will never see life outside of jail again. GG. Rest in peace, Nino. Rest in peace, Kizzy. With Our this peace. much violence surrounding Molly Strip and their opposition, police would start to watch what the gangs did closely. But it yep. wouldn't be until 2021 when the police would crack down on Molly Strip and arrest members for selling Class A drugs. On the 8th of January 2019, an LGR GM known as Jay Sav, who was only 14, was out yeah, selling drugs weird, on his bike weird. late at night. On this same night, five Our Molly Strip gang members were riding out in a stolen Mercedes looking for ops. They would spot Jay Sav and would drive into him whilst he was riding on his moped instantly killing him. The Molly Strip GMs would then get out of the car stabbing him nine times even though he had already passed away. Jay Mike. Sav had moved to London in order to get closer to his grandma who lived there. This entire incident was also caught on CCTV, but it is way too graphic for me to show here. A Molly Strip member named AB was the only one arrested for the murder, whilst the other members have not been arrested. AB would be caught on CCTV in a shop buying cigarettes. Ten minutes after the murder took place, he was arrested hours later and was given life with a minimum of 21 years. This was a prime example of two kids caught up in the wrong life. AB was abused during his upbringing and his dad was killed in King's Cross. This would make him vulnerable to being groomed into that lifestyle. Jay Sav's life was also just beginning, but he fell in I with the wrong crowd baby. and would like, be selling on, drugs from young. All around it's a sad situation. Rest in peace Terribly to Jay sad. Sav, my prayers go out to R. his family. R. After Facts. this murder, there would be lots of tit-for-tat incidents between LGR and Mali Strip, resulting in stabbings and shootings. And later yeah. in 2019, we would see the first instance of a Mali Strip member making music. After this murder, a Mali Strip member named would Richie would burst onto the scene and start dropping Richie. UK drill bangers, like Crooks and Bingo. It was alleged that Richie was present at the double murder murder of two Leighton Stone GMs in 2014, named Fox and Hollow, but would flee England for five years and return in 2019. This is not confirmed, but alleged. A few other Molly Strip members would also start rapping during 2019 and 2020. This included Rondo Montana, Riddler, and Baby Mane. Okay, These songs would blow up Rondo and catch and a Riddler. lot of attention from UK drill fans. LGR would also start dropping rude songs, dissing Molly Strip consistently. A lot of instances of violence between Molly Strip and LGR are explained in their drill songs. Like, oh, what the fuck are these damn songs? Like, again, I'm used to it. Come on. And my drill, it gets nasty over there. All right. It gets damn disgusting. Absolutely damn outrageous over there. But golly, man. This shit never gets old, I'll tell you that much. This shit is still insane. Oh, didn't end up dead. Green on the PIC, this IC free the song, I think. They go to numbers, we go to heart. You know, it's like a hundred man v ten right now. Guarantee they still run so fast. Them man gas could they kill one kid. We done took more than a few of your dogs. Rest in peace, G Savage, and next your savage of more than heart. I swear you done jack. Rims dipped in through the window, we did a limbo where the car was swerving. That day when the you got bun is bull chai rum and these youths ain't learning. Nineteen pellets in his in June 2020, Richie would announce he was leaving the road life and quitting music to focus on religion, which is the best outcome oh, from wow. this road life. In a lot of instances, it's jail Respect, or death, Richie. but it is good to see that Richie has left that life behind. Rondo Montana was recalled to prison in 2020 Tough. after dropping his first song. He would start writing bars in prison, and when he came out in 2021, okay, a lot of his friends were arrested and charged with conspiracy to supply Class A drugs. This is when Rondo Montana would start taking music seriously, as he saw what the roads had done to people around him. Ridla and Rondo would drop duo freestyles together that would get hundreds of thousands of views. Whilst Molly Strip still frequently diss LGR and Priory Court in songs, the beef is not as active as it was in 2017 nowadays. The truth about this life is that no one is winning in these situations. Not at all. Both gangs have lost close friends and have lost friends to prison. Rondo Montana recently did an interview about his life as a Molly Strip member, and you can tell he is very hurt about losing EJ, who was his friend. And the person. Kid, I guess, bro, baby. Who murdered your friend? What, what happened to him? He, he got arrested, store. He's in jail, he's riding last for it right now. Man, 
literally sit storm. You burn it. Whilst this life that drill rappers live looks appealing, it's really killer or be killed when you're surrounded by this life. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more videos like this. Let me know if I have missed or gotten any info wrong, and drop any video ideas in the comments below. And interesting, interesting video. UK drill uh, plug, uh, good shit. Good video, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate you, Caden, once again, for the recommendation. Um, yeah, man, RIP everybody mentioned. This is crazy, man. It's crazy to see what y'all got going down in the UK, man. It's crazy to see that no matter where you are on this earth, there's something going on, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, man, links in the description getting to them. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Y'all take it easy. Good boop, 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 boop. Good boy.